Hi, today I'm going to uh, tell you about the coronavirus disease 2019 that is shortly called COVID-19. So a coronavirus disease or uh, COVID-19 is a infectious disease that caused by the virus and increasing day by day in the human population. Coronavirus disease COVID-19 is a virus more specifically a coronavirus identified as the cause of an outbreak of respiratory illness that first detected in Wuhan, China. Coronavirus disease causes infection in the respiratory tract of the human body that finally causes the infection in the lungs that causes death of the human. So these are the structure uh, these are the images of the structure of the influenza virus. That the structure of these uh, influenza virus is identical uh, to the uh, coronavirus. So here are the here are the spikes on the uh, surface of this virus. These spikes are actually cause infection in the human body. So these spikes are made up of proteins, two different type of proteins that cause infection in the human body. So what type of symptoms there would be in the uh, in the patients with the coronavirus. So reported illnesses have ranged from mild symptoms to severe illness and death for confirmed coronavirus diseases 2019 or COVID-19 cases. So whenever you see the report, so whenever you see the report, you will, uh, you will read, you will see three types of terminology, mild symptoms, severe symptoms and death symptoms. So a person in the mild means that it can be covered easily. A person, a patient with the severe symptoms, it can be recovered with the, uh, with extreme hard work. When a person enters into a death state, it means that the person is finished, the patient is expired now. So symptoms of coronavirus. So the following symptoms may appear to 2 to 14 days after exposure. Why 2 to 14 days uh, after exposure? Because this virus fight with the immune state of the immunity of the living organisms. So number the, the symptoms, uh, the patient with uh, first symptoms will be a shortness of the breath. Second one be coughing or sneezing. And the third one is fever, a temperature will be in the dead patients. So here is the story of the some special type of cells which are responsible in, in the fight with the against the uh, virus any coronavirus or any virus uh, or any pathogen particles so mechanism of immune cells are immunity so we, uh, you have studied about that you have uh, heard about the uh, white blood cells so white blood cells are the responsible for defensive systems so defensive system is actually the immune system that work against any specific pathogens uh, or any foreign particles uh, that is uh, enter into the uh, that enter into the body. So two types of white blood cells are present: T lymphocytes, T lymphocyte and B. So first we have T lymphocytes and the second one T, uh, B lymphocytes. T lymphocytes and B lymphocytes are both develop in the bone marrow, but T lymphocyte cells develop in the bone marrow and mature in the thymus. That is a structure. That is the structure present outside the bone marrow. But thymus is a glandular structure of the lymphatic tissues. So T lymphocytes have two types of cells: helper T cells and killer T cells. From the name, it is clear that helper T cells recognize or identify the foreign particles, that is, bacteria, viruses, and fungi, etc. While killer, while killer T cells kill that particles that recognize by the T cells. So B lymphocyte cells. These are the antibodies producing immune cells that fight against any pathogens. So here uh, I tell you, uh, I will tell you about the B lymphocytes. That B lymphocytes, uh, uh, B lymphocytes uh, produces antibodies. So the antibodies and antigens. Here the antigen is bacteria, virus, or fungi. So the antibodies act against the uh, specific antigens. So the antibodies antigen reaction is very specific. So precaution: frequently wash hands with soap or sanitizer. Make use of of a smart slides. Precautions: frequently wash hands with soaps or sanitizers. Make use of face mask to avoid any germ 
inhalation. Keep your home and houses clean and remove any waste material out of the homes. Avoid places where there is a gathering of the people or crowds. So these are the precautions. These are the careful instructions that you can uh, follow. Uh, that you can follow uh, them. Uh, uh, wash your hands for the 20 seconds uh, with the soap or any sanitizer. Uh, sanitizers. Thanks for watching this video.